O oh, Muslim, guess what I discovered? Read Quran Surah 33, verse 72. And, uh, oh, by the way, the reason why I'm using this uh, camera instead of yours is because I feel this is going to be pulled, uh, pulled off. So I'm getting a totally different angle here. So anyway. I'll continue here. A Muslim, guess what I discovered? In Quran 33, verse 72, it really sounds like Allah is making fun of people who become Muslim. If you don't believe me, here it is. This is Al Atkap. Atkap. Oh, Azab. Azab. Okay. And it is, yeah, 30, uh, I got uh, 3372. And if you think I'm uh, taking it out of context, we'll read the scripture before and after and see if you think I still am taking it out of, out of context. But the reason why it sounds like Allah is making fun of those who become Muslim, it says this, okay, this is the literal word by word, and here's the Arabic. If you don't believe me. Okay. Indeed, we. That's all I'm saying we. Because even though Shirk is un unpardonable, unforgivable, he likes to call, uh, he likes to call himself we. Uh, offered the trust to the heavens and the earth and the mountains. But they refused to bear it. And they feared from it. In other words, they're a afraid to take all this trust but bore it the man indeed he will he was unjust and ignorant so the reason why the man became trustful of Allah is because he's ignorant it's, it seems to say here okay but now I'll read uh, this is from Islam Awakened and you'll see uh, what I mean here, how it seems to, how the Quran, Quran 33, verse 72, seems to be making fun of those who become Muslim. Okay, verily we, that's all again, even though shirk is, un, un, is unforgivable, we did offer the trust of reason and volition to the heavens and the earth and the mountains, but they refused to bear it because they were afraid of it. <laughs> Yet man took it up, for verily he has always been prone to be most wicked, most foolish. So in other words, you're foolish if you if you become trustful of Allah. Okay, now this is M.M. Pixel. Lo, we offered the trust unto the heavens and the earth and the hills, but they shrank from burying it and were afraid of it, afraid to trust in Allah. Who knew? Who knew that mountains were smart? You know what I mean. And man assumed it. Lo, he hath proved a tyrant and a fool. So if you are, if you become Muslim or trust in Allah, you're a tyrant and a fool. Okay, here's the Shakir per version. Surely we offered the trust to the heavens and the earth and the mountains, but they refused to be unfaithful to it and feared from it. And man has turned unfaithful to it. Surely is unjust, ignorant. Hmm. And, well, that seems to contradict the other verses, uh, the other Qurans. So I'll now try pick, uh, Yusuf Ali. Yusuf Ali said this. We did indeed offer the trust to the heavens and the earth and the mountains, but they refused to undertake it. Again, who knew mountains and the earth and were, were, in so, were so intelligent? Uh, but they refused to undertake it, being afraid thereof. They were afraid to trust Allah. Uh, but it goes on to say this, uh, but man undertook it. He was indeed, he was indeed unjust and foolish. So it was, a man was foolish for trusting Allah. That's what the, that's what the quote clear signs, you know, the, the, the quote clear signs, that's what the Quran calls itself, clear signs. That's what the Quran seems to be saying to me here. So, yeah, so the man took it because he's foolish. He, he trusted Allah. Okay, here's another version. All right. 
Truly, we presented the trust to the heavens and the earth and the mountains, but they refused to carry it and were apprehensive of it. They were afraid of Allah and trusting Allah. They were apprehensive of it. But the human being carried it, because, you know, humans, I guess, are stupid. Truly, and I'll tell you why. Truly, he had been wrongdoing, very ignorant. In other words, if man wasn't ignorant, he wouldn't have, he would have been like the mountains and refused all his trust. That's what comes down to it here. Okay, here's another version. We offered the trust to the heavens and the earth and the mountains, but they refused to bear it because they were afraid of it. Didn't trust Allah. The mountains and the earth and the sky. Yeah, the, 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 the heavens and the earth and the mountains didn't trust Allah because they were afraid of it. But man bore it. He surely proved unjust and ignorant. So, not only, so if you become a Muslim or you trust Allah, you're unjust and ignorant according to this. Okay, how about, okay, now, now this guy, this guy is named Al-Matakhab. Al and he, he puts a lot of explanation here. So he writes it this way. We, that's Allah again, even though shirk is unpardonable, offered the trust, unquote, to the heavens and the earth and the mountains. I don't know why he puts it in quotes, but anyway. Uh, heavens and earth and mountains with what it entails of expectations of knowing and reasoning, of feeling and thinking, of obligations and responsibilities, but they decline to bear it for what it involves, for it involves a burdensome consequences. But man... Adam, his genes, accepted it and was willing to bear the responsibility and to give an undertaking of fidelity. And you know why? Well, I'll read on here. He was indeed unfair to himself, having no knowledge of the logical sequences. In other words, the mountains and the earth and the heavens are smarter than man because man trusted Allah. That's what, it's, that's what this thing is saying. You know, you're, un, you're, you're unjust, you're foolish and stupid. Well, it doesn't say stupid yet, but you're foolish. And uh, you don't know what's in your ignorant, and that's why you accept all. That's why you trust Allah. But the mountains were afraid. And, and, and Allah doesn't call them stupid or foolish. Let's see if I can find another one here. Okay, here's another one. This is Ali Uno. We offered the trust of the heavens and the earth and the mountains, but they shrank from burying it and were afraid of it. It says, fearful being unable to fulfill its responsibility. Uh, uh, that's what that's added in there. But human has undertaken it. And why? Well, we gone here. He is indeed prone to doing great wrong and misguiding. That's why he, in other words, that's why he accepted all his trust and acting out of sheer ignorance. In other words, if you trust in Allah, you're ignorant. That's what that's telling me. Isn't that something? It's like Allah is attacking you for trusting him. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> the, in other words, the mountains and the earth, and the, in, in other words, inanimate objects without any brains are smarter than Muslims. Those who trust in Allah. That's what that's telling me. But if you, uh, if you disagree with me, let me know why you disagree with me, okay? 